So today in our um, Features of the Backyard program, we are actually at a river close to our house. Now, if you can safely go out still and responsibly can, can be away from people like what we are, there's hardly anyone around, you're still allowed to go and explore these places. Now, rivers are awesome places, they're full of life. But if you're going out at daytime, it's very, very important to be sun smart. Nihan, how do we be sun smart? What do we wear? So, um, we wear long sleeves. Yeah, long sleeves. You have to have a hat covering your, covering your sides of the face. And what's and the most important thing? What do you put on your skin? Sunscreen and sunnies. Sunscreen and sunnies if you can work with sunnies outside. So, we are ready. We are going to go and do some netting. So, we... We normally use these small nets and catch fish, but today, like my dad made, and it will cut. It will help us catch more. Uh, so basically, we hold, someone holds this end, and someone else holds the other end, and, and we drag this on the water. Like that, and then we go to the shore and see how much fish we caught. Awesome. So, yeah, so we made this yesterday. It cost like $20. We got a old fishing net, uh, like a mosquito net, and a couple of these poles. You can use normal sticks, cable tied together. Now, if we drag this on the bottom, um, we'll be scooping in quite a few things. Do you want to give it a go? Yes. Yeah. All right, let's give it a go. See, we are scooping the bottom. This is a much easier way of doing it and you can cover a larger... Guys, move away from each other a bit. Yeah. All right, awesome. Let's see whether we got anything. Bring it all the way to the show and put it on the floor. What do we have? Oh, there's oh, there's oh, a lot of fish there. Brian, what fish. did we get? We got all of these are hardy heads. The small fish, eh? Yeah. So basically, this every single one is a hardy head. See? Oh, there's a dolphin just here. Oh, look at that! Look at that! Look at that! See, this is why you should explore these places. Look at those. That's amazing, eh? Are you filming Yeah, those are the Pacific bottle nose dolphins. What else have we got? We have got snails, which are a type of in the mollusk group. Mollusk. It's a mollusk, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. They're grasses, they, they feed on the sea algae, the grasses, right? And, and there are other animals that eat snails in Britain. Some fish actually eat snails. What have you got here? Jellies. Oh, do you know what type they are? What are they? Brown jellies. Can you pick one gently up? There's another one here, right here. Now, brown, can I have that? Brown jellyfish are stingless as adults, so they don't they don't have the stingers to hurt you. But still, it's best not to actually touch them or pick them up if you don't know what you're doing. And what's the general rule with uh, jellyfish kids? You never put them on the show, and you just don't Who's touch coming them. Here? Oh, a few blacks. Absolutely. So this is one of the biggest flying birds you get around um, around Perth, around our place. Now, would you play with these guys? No. No, no they can be really aggressive. So one important thing if you're going out and you see these beautiful birds, see, keep your distance and do not Once eat you them. study animals, what's the most important thing, kids? Put them back where they came from. Put them back where they came from very, very safely. And, and do not hurt them. Can you re release them, Rohan? 
So there you go. That was a very quick visit to the river close to our place. As you can see, there's a lot to see, a lot to learn and a lot to explore. See you next time on Backyard Creatures. See ya. Bye.